Yeah, right there. Ow! Very good. You okay? <laughs> I'm fine. What is going on crack addicts? Welcome back to the channel. Now in today's video, I'm gonna be posting a wide variety of chiropractic adjustments from some of your favorite chiropractors, some of the most loved ones and most well-known on YouTube. So that's what you're gonna be seeing in today's video with some new additions also. All of their links will be in the description. That's where you can check them out directly. And if you haven't already, make sure you hit the subscribe button to the channel and make sure you turn on post notifications so you don't miss any content from the channel. Now let's get into it and I'll see you on the next one. Up next, we have Dr. Scott Hall. Okay, so I do feel a little bit of restriction right there and I wanna get that moving. And like I said, the more flexibility in the upper part of your neck, that's going to protect that lower part of your neck, okay? Okay. Yeah, right there. Ow! Very good. You okay? <laughs> I'm fine. All right. Drop. Awesome. And now we can move a little bit better there. Uh, it was, I'm sorry, it was your right side. I'm gonna adjust a, the lower section of your neck here, okay? Very good. Ow. That hurt? Yes. Make a fist. Pushing down, resist. I think that was stronger. There you go. Let me get in there. Look up, relax your elbow. Take a deep breath, breathe on out. Good. Oh my god. That feels so much better. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. It's okay. Are you, are you all right? Yes. I know. That's definitely a problem. Yeah? I already know it. Yeah. Deep breath. Let it go. Good. <laughs> that one tender okay let it go breathe out good that hurt yes hold it right here i'm gonna push out that way don't let me much better huh <laughs> yes that way don't do that just resist my pressure remember ready it's very strong yes make a fist i'm pushing down resist Great. I don't think we need to do that side. Hold it right there. I'm going to push that way. Don't let me do that. Ready? <laughs> that one's a little weak. Let it go. Good. <laughs> On top. <laughs> Hold it right there. Pushing that way. Don't let me. Yeah. Gotta... Yeah, I put a lot that of pressure one. on my chest. Yeah. I'm scared already. <laughs> yeah. Breathe out. Let it go. Good. Hold. What I'm going to do is feel for the different segments of your rib cage and your mid back. That's a little stuck. Okay. Sit your chin up to your chest like a sit up. Like that. And breathe out. We're gonna have you flip around on your belly. Your head up a little bit. Yeah, let that drop. Ow! All right, back to neutral. Take a deep breath, breathe on out. Okay. Is this hurting pretty good? Yes. 
Okay. Right there. Yeah, we got a nice knot right here. We have a lot of soft tissue tension. Let it go. All right, muscle test. I'm going to straighten your knee. Don't let me do that. Ready? Good. Ow. That hurt? Yeah, we're trying that. Take a deep breath. Breathe out. Ow. Good. Okay. All right, so your right hip flexor tested weak. The nerve roots that come out of your spine right here are what control that hip flexor. So take a deep breath, breathe out. Let it go. Let it go. There we go. Wow, what yeah. a pop. Yeah. Now I need to send all of my clients here. Yeah. I want you to straighten your leg and bring it back as far as you can and then back to the starting position. Okay, we'll do this four or five, maybe six times. Ready, go. All the way, all the way, further. And back to the start. And go. Good. Again. Okay, lay on your back. Are you okay with this shot? Yeah. Especially right there, right? Okay. Great. Next up, we have Dr. Scott Mitchell and Dr. Matt Delgado. Let me have you go face down to start, please. Perfect. Good, just like that. And then remember, you got the easy job. All you gotta do is be nice and relaxed and breathe down into your diaphragm. So one of the first things we notice when we come down here and check your leg length, and make sure, yeah, is that it's shorter on that right leg by about a half inch right now. But when I come up like this, it actually gets even. Are you able to see it from that angle? Yeah, nice and even. And then when I go like this and bring her heels towards her butt, the right leg definitely goes closer than the left one. And she was even saying she can feel the right one touch, but the left one doesn't. So what this is letting me know, oh, also what she was saying with her pelvis being in pain is that she feels the pain mostly on that right side, right inside here. So what this is letting me know is that the pelvis is rocked backwards on that right side and that the sacrum right here, this triangle bone is pushed backwards on this left side. So all you gotta do is a quick little adjustment to be able to fix that. So let me have you lay on your side facing me this way, please. Oh, can you tell the camera that you are a self cracker too? Oh yeah, I'm a self, do you want me to crack right now? No, 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 okay. no way you absolutely not, no, we're trying to fix that. <laughs> it feels so good, is this okay? Or yeah, 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 I'm gonna put you in the right position. Okay. But during our chit chat and we were doing different, uh, talking about this and that, she just looks at me and goes, <laughs> <laughs> I've only had that happen one time in my office where someone looks at me and just cracks their neck. <laughs> I'm sorry, I didn't know it. it's so normal for me. <laughs> but so see, uh, again, it's because it feels normal because we want to be able to find out exactly where it's stuck. So in this case, it's right here in the right part of the pelvis. So this is just the best position to help free up those three bones that make up the pelvis. So this way, all I do is I roll you over and I just push it back to where it needs to go. Okay. Right in here. And this is the one that's been there for 27 years. Mm -hmm. Right there. Good. Good. Oh my God. Just like What? That. Have you ever done that crack before? No. Mm -mm. Oh my God. You tell the camera if that hurt? That, no, it didn't hurt at all. Did it feel like it was a spot that just needed to go? Yeah, and I also kind of felt it go up my spine a little bit. Like it felt more like mid-back, which probably takes like a lot of pressure oh, yeah. every day to compensate for the I'm, misalignment. A perfect person to <laughs> now come in. <laughs> so we bend this one. So that was for the right ilium. This one's now for the left sacrum. Okay. Right here, on the left part of the sacrum. That's like right on here. Perfect, right 
Yeah. Oh my god. Better? That felt so good. <laughs> <laughs> Beautiful. Oh, yeah, I'm addicted to this. <laughs> Let me have you go face down again. We can double check to see if we made a difference. Okay. Beautiful. Wait, I've never cracked like that ever. Yeah, see, that's an area. So those are called your SI joints. Mm -hmm. SI joint stands for sacroiliac joint. So where those three bones come together, mm -hmm. every time people crack their low back, they're trying to crack this area for the most, well not every time, but the majority of time. Mm -hmm. They're trying to crack this area inside here, mm -hmm. but they end up cracking here or here or here or here. Yeah. This way of adjusting is so important because it actually adjusts the SI joints right inside here correctly. And then we come down here and legs are perfectly even. Staying even. And then let me know if that already feels a little bit different when I go like this. Yeah, I feel like my left can get closer. Mm -hmm. And I feel like my right isn't overcompensating as much. Look at that. Overcompensation. She knows she knows all the big words. <laughs> She's never been adjusted. I was like, oh, we're gonna get along. Perfect. And one of the things that we noticed too is that as you were as we were standing and leaning your body backwards, remember your right shoulder started to go up with it as well? Yeah. So let's let me know right inside here. Misalignments. Let me have you turn over onto your back, please. Yeah, what I want you to do is give yourself a nice big hug like this. So I'm talking big hug, like you really oh, love like yourself. This. There you go. <laughs> I'm just going to roll you over this way. Find an area right inside here between the shoulder blades. Good. Time we take a big breath in. And let it all the way out. I'm just going to roll you back. Tuck your chin a little bit. Oh, wow. There we go. That felt great. If you made it to the end of the video, guys and girls, thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe for more.